I'm Ian from National Numeracy and I'm visiting Derwin College in Shropshire today to have a big number natter. Derwin College work with adults with SEND and we're going to talk about their feelings about maths and how they use it every day. Hello, my name is Josh and I am a performing arts student here at Derwin College. Hi, my name is Megan and I'm a performing arts student at Derwin College. Hi, my name is Lauren and I am a retail student at Devon College. How do you feel about maths? Um, I don't like them. Not very good. Overwhelmed. Why do you feel that way about maths? Well, I just find them quite stressful because a lot of the times you have to use your brain like if you're in a shop or something you don't really see people like you know take out a calculator or whatever or or in any other situation where you're having to use maths skills because i'm not very good at thinking about like numbers adding them up in my head and stuff like that i get very confused and it stresses me out so i i, I just feel i'd say i feel anxious when i do them because i i always feel like i'll get them wrong and i get really stressed after that as well um, because sometimes I'm really good at addition, subtractions, and tables, and, but I'm not really good at time or anything, and any anything else. I get sh struggling with it. And it can be quite overwhelming. Like lots to do, lots to remember, different subjects all the time. English is a bit easier because it's all words, and some people have a feel of numbers, or they have like number like there. I don't know if that's the right term, but sexy boy numbers, it's not clear if that's the word. Um, that, and they get a bit, like, worried they're going to get it wrong, maybe, or they become a bit paranoid about numbers. Also, I found much hard, I didn't like having it on my timetable. Um, I didn't like reading that I've had it, and uh, I had to go to that. I didn't like that. I prefer it here because it's embedded into my work. Do you use maths in your workplace? I guess numbers, yeah, because yeah, sometimes um, because I'm a performing arts student and if we're doing dancing or any types of performance, they might tell you to stand in a certain position or they'll say take this many steps forward or backwards, so that's obviously using your numbers, three steps forward or whatever. Um, and like if we're doing dancing or something, it might say, turn around three times, go that many times. So that's numbers. So I, I guess we do we use numbers and maths, I suppose. I do like count the beats or the music. And then when like, um, when I, Opal's there, um, I just count the beats and what moves I do, like, when it starts and how when it's finished and also at singing with amy and like counting when i come in i certainly do i am a retail student so i use it when i'm counting stock i have to make sure that everything is correct and there are no incorrect numbers because then Alfie won't be able to put numbers on the system properly. What would help you to feel more confident about maths? Probably a bit of support, yeah. I think I need a lot of help and actually I need a lot more detail to actually make it more easier for me. Teachers have to be the right kind of teachers for the person, but it's really hard because everyone has different learning levels and different reasons for once some people might be really good at maths some people might not be so good at maths learning in a fun way visual learning is really good i find that if i have some visual in front of me it's easier for me to learn and easier for me to connect with what i'm doing and understand it better